Hot Springs Village Inside Out is a closer look at the greatness of Hot Springs Village, Arkansas and the surrounding areas, people, places, experiences. Hot Springs Village is one of the most beautiful places on earth. Join me, Randy Cantrell, and my co-host Dennis Simpson as we engage in weekly conversations to explore Hot Springs Village Inside Out. Today's show is brought to you by Central Arkansas's favorite radio station, KVRE. Find them on the dial at 92.9 FM. Stream them live at kvre.com. Remax of Hot Springs Village. The award-winning Remax of Hot Springs Village is the largest real estate office inside the village with over 30 full-time agents and support staff. Visit them to learn more about this beautiful place to solve your real estate needs. Call them today at 1-800-364-9007. Find them online at explorehsv.com. They are Remax of Hot Springs Village at 1-800-364-9007 or online at explorehsv.com. Ike Eisenhower State Farm. Ike and his award-winning team have been serving the insurance needs of folks all around Hot Springs Village since 1998. Ike has qualified for State Farm's President's Club, Chairman's Circle, and Hot Springs Village Insurance Agent of the Year. Call Ike Eisenhower State Farm today at 501-984-4100. That's 501-984-4100. Find them online at IkeEisenhower.net. Call them today for all your insurance needs because, like a good neighbor, Ike Eisenhower State Farm is there. Dennis Simpson, Inside Out, here with the lovely Miss Laverne and Miss Phyllis. Laverne, say hi. Hi. And Miss Phyllis. Hello. These ladies are from AR Ship, S H I I P. And, and Laverne, tell me what ship AR Ship is. How does this work? Arkansas SHIP, that's what AR is for. So Arkansas SHIP is your local senior health insurance information program. We are here to help Medicare individuals navigate the complexities of Medicare. There are complexities in Medicare? Who knew? Who knew? <laughs> no one knew. Miss <Dennis. laughs> Phyllis, tell us, give us a ballpark. What What are some of the challenges? Why, why do people want to call AR SHIP? Because it, it is a great resource. We are a great resource, so people want to know what, what the best plan for them would be. So here at SHIP, we don't tell them what their best plan would be. We give them the information of the plans that are that are available in their area, and then we, you know, let them make their informed decision of which plan would be best for them. But, but y'all don't sell anything. Is that correct? Because this is a governmental agency. You're not trying to sell Medicare or Medicaid, right? Mm, that is correct. We do not okay. sell anything. So, so you're not selling anything. So, I mean, Phyllis, give me one more time here. So what's the purpose of SHIP is just to, com to connect me to somebody who's qualified to talk about it? That is correct. Laverne and I are the Medicare coordinators. Uh, we train and educate our Medicare counselors once a year. They have to take a yearly test and then we do all the Medicare updates for our partner offices as well as our Medicare counselors um, for, you know, becoming trained Medicare counselors. I, I don't know if you realize, but as you said that, I felt like one of those little dogs in the window because I tilted my head like, really? I didn't, you have to... <laughs> I realize now, so these are the, the people that you work with or that you help educate are obviously providers and they have to meet a certain standard of, of excellence. Is that correct, Laverne? Yes, that is correct. That's why we say we have trained, certified Medicare counselors throughout the state of Arkansas. They are located within our partner offices, such as our area agencies on aging. Those are our uh, SHIP Medicare partners. And again, throughout the state, we have um, different partner offices that we have trained and certified Medicare counselors ready to assist Medicare individuals. Now, it, it, Lord willing, in just a a lot of years, I'm going to turn that big six, five. Okay. And, and there's a window now I'm, I'm born around the middle of the year. So I'm in July. So there's a window that I can, can sign up 
but but are there is there any other time? How does this work? What do I do? So when you're Medicare eligible and you're going to retire, you've made that decision. Medicare individuals have an initial enrollment period and they have a general enrollment period. These two periods are designed for Medicare individuals to enroll into their Medicare benefits. So that initial window is a seven month period, which is three months before the 65th birthday, the month of the 65th birthday month. And then there's three months after the Medicare individuals turn 65. That's that seven month window that Medicare individuals are encouraged to enroll into their Medicare benefits. Okay, so I, how, how I'm having this, in, in my mind, I'm a real simple guy. So Laverne's telling me the right way to do this, but I may or may not procrastinate sometimes, uh, uh, Phyllis, and I may or may not get everything done by that. So what's my other window? If I miss that window, what else can I do? So there's what we call a GEP or a general enrollment period, and that time is January the 1st through March the 31st, which is coming up very soon. Mm -hmm. You can also en enroll in your Part A or your Part B Medicare, or we also, there's another window March, uh, it's called the Medicare Advantage open enrollment period. Mm -hmm. And during this enrollment period, you have to be enrolled in a Medicare Advantage plan on January the 1st. And if you do not like that Advantage plan, you can disenroll from that Advantage plan. You can return to original Medicare during this time is January the 1st through March the 31st, the same time frame. Or you can go back to original Medicare, which means that all you have to do is enroll in a Part D plan, and that will take you back to original Medicare. Now, Phyllis, just just curious, why is there a problem? Why would I not like my plan? Is it, and you know, I was diabetic and I became, or I wasn't diabetic and then I became, or some life change, or is it just, Something I didn't like? Sometimes people just for some reason don't like their Medicare Advantage plan. Say, for instance, they went to the doctor. Um, they had to wait on a referral. Say, for instance, with the <clears throat> Medicare Advantage plans, you uh, referrals are required. So sometimes it may take them longer to get that referral through a Medicare Advantage plan. And then they just get upset because they're waiting so long for that referral, then they say, well, I want to go back to original Medicare. So a lot of times that's what they do. They just experience some type of problem with that Medicare Advantage plan. Phyllis, Phyllis, say it ain't so. You really? <laughs> Come on. People, unhappy people? No, not in Arkansas, right? Yes, it is. <laughs> I can imagine. I can imagine. So, and, and Laverne, let me, let me get this. So, so the the oops period or the I get to redo is from January first roughly if I'm already I have to be already enrolled but that's roughly from January first to March thirty first is that correct? That's correct. So an individual has to be on January first enrolled in a Medicare Advantage plan, and again during this time period January first through March thirty first they can switch to another Advantage plan or they can go back to original Medicare. You know, and, and I, I, I'm in my mind, I'm trying to navigate all these pieces. And number one, this is why it's so important. And, and I'm, I'm going to speak this point if I can. AR SHIP, S H I I P, a governmental organization run in every state in the United States. And it is a free government sponsored program to help you navigate the Medicare, Medicaid waters. Is that fair enough? That is correct. Okay. And, and the reason where I'm going with that is, is because I, I know when I turned 65, I get Medicare if I if I want it or not. I'm going to get it, but that only covers like the the hospital room or anything like that. I can imagine, I, I can envision a million, uh, maybe more permutations of okay. I've got room insurance in the ho in the hospital, but my doctors aren't covered. But my it it just seems endless without knowing what I need to know and without calling you guys. Is that right, Laverne? That is correct. So under Medicare, Medicare individuals have Medicare Parts A and B for mm -hmm. individuals who've worked, 20, I'm sorry, 10 years, 40 quarters. There is no monthly premium for your hospital Part A. Then Medicare individuals have Medicare Part B, which covers their providers and doctors. And those Medicare B, there is a monthly premium that individuals have to pay for their Medicare Part B. It's not free. 
I was about to say it's not free, but I can see how this can get complicated very, very quickly. Yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, ladies, I tell you what. So the objective is if you have a problem and you're already enrolled and you want to make a change, you need to do it before March 31st. Is that correct? That's correct. For Medicare Advantage, individuals who are in the Medicare Advantage plan. So so would they just contact their, their insurance provider if they wanted to check with any contact to Arkansas SHIP? What, what's the way to do this? We absolutely want you to call Arkansas SHIP. We are a trusted program and we provide absolutely free services and counseling. We're not going to benefit. We're not going to profit off of enrolling you into a Medicare Advantage plan. Again, that's what makes us different. We're free, unbiased, confidential Medicare exports. We're here to help you. I, I tell you what. And, and, number, and yeah, Phyllis, let, me, let me give you our phone number. Our phone number please. is what? 1-800-224-6330. 224-6330, right? And, and, you know, you ladies both hit on it very clearly. There's so much, there's so many, many moving parts and so many variables, and there's so many pieces that you could do. It's literally like having a friend in the Medicare business. Is that true? That is true. We are your ship friends. So so now, and, and we, we may have covered this before, but I want to make sure I call the ship number. You're not going to sell me anything. You're not going to even, even counsel me. You're just going to send me to another organization locally in my county or nearby that's going to help me really navigate these waters, right? Yes, that is correct. So the the the, the and then as as I'm understanding it, uh, Miss Laverne and and Miss Phyllis, y'all are the ones that actually train the people I'm going to be talking to. Is that correct? That's correct. We do the training, and it, there are uh, lots of occasions if they're wanting to speak to a counselor in our office, we do a, a help to assist with counseling as well. We have lots of friends that we've met throughout the years. We're here to counsel as well. Well, you know, I, I went to the chiropractor the other day and at the very end of the of the session, the love, lovely lady came up and she said, do you want therapy? And I said, no, I, I love my mom. I don't I don't know. <laughs> yeah. So so when you're talking about counseling, I'm like, well, you mean like, you know, no, I get your point. I get your point. Miss Laverne, Miss Phyllis, thank you all for joining us today on Hot Springs Village Inside Out. Medicare counseling. <laughs> Medicare. Oh, oh, oh. Now you go qualifying things. <laughs> now, now there's a caveat. Now there's a definition. Yeah, 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 yeah. A qualifier. I tell you what, we will see you next time. Would you ladies come back and visit with us again? Yes, yeah. absolutely. Thank it you. would be a pleasure. Dennis Simpson, Hot Springs Village Inside Out. We will see you next time. Thanks for watching and listening to Hot Springs Village Inside Out, a weekly podcast starring Hot Springs Village, Arkansas. Visit the website at hotspringsvillageinsideout.com.